Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for May 12th of 2022. Well, it is titled Young Stars of NGC 346. So what do we see here? Well, this is actually a portion of a nearby galaxy known as the Small Magellanic Cloud and is an example of a star forming region and a group cluster of young stars, which is still in the process of formation. Now when stars form, they don't all form at the same time. So some parts of the gas cloud that form the stars may start to condense first, and more massive stars will form more quickly as well. So the very massive stars will form first. And while they are forming and going through their lives, lower mass stars such as stars like our sun or even smaller, continue their formation process. So we don't get a great clump of stars all forming at once, although relatively quickly, at least from astronomical time frames. Now we see them here still surrounded by some of the material from which they formed and we can see evidence of gas and dust here. The gas in the pink color is the emission of a hydrogen gas. When hydrogen gas is excited, it will give off a distinct red color that we see here as pink. And we'll also see some of the dust kind of around the edges of this where stars have already formed and where new stars are still in the process of forming. But the cluster towards the center is a relatively young cluster with a lot of blue stars, hot blue stars that do not live for a very long time, maybe only a few millions of years. So this tells us again that the star formation is recent. In addition, we still see the remnants of the gas and dust around them. And as the stars form, they will slowly eat away at that material, pushing it back outward and dissipating it into space. So eventually there will be just the cluster of stars here. Right now we can still see some of that debris left over from the star formation. But over time, hundreds of thousands of years, that material will slowly get pushed out by the stars that have formed. And the star formation will cease as the material is no longer enough gas and dust to form new stars. And then we will just see the cluster that remains. And as I said, this is actually not part of our own galaxy, but part of a satellite galaxies of, of ours known as the Small Magellanic Cloud, which orbits our Milky Way. So that was our picture of the day for May 12th of 2022. It was titled Young Stars of NGC 346. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.